I want to share with you our credit unions that are better than Navy Fed. The thing is, when you think about Navy Fed or when you think about credit unions in general, everybody thinks about Navy Fed. Navy Fed here, Navy Fed there. I mean, before you know it, you think Navy Fed is actually the best of the best. No, there are actually uh, credit unions that are better than Navy Fed. In today's conversation, I'll show you with proof why some of the top seven, top ten uh, credit unions I'll share with you are are actually better than Navy Fed. And uh, so, he so here's a list I want you to think about. The first credit union that is better than uh, Navy Fed is Connexus. Why why Connexus? Connexus actually uh, offers you uh, a, a variety of loans and credit cards, lines of credit, and what have you. And I'm not even talking about the banking side of things. I mean, uh, Connexus is really great in terms of uh, in terms of a banking because they have a uh, they they get they have a uh, checking, they have savings account, MMAs, CDs, and and, and whatnot. So that's kind of cool. But what we love about Connexus is actually uh, the customer friendly uh the a very customer friendly uh like uh the the orientation of the credit union okay and uh, so you can get approved within 24 hours this is really great i mean something that you will never hear when you actually uh contemplate the uh, navy fed navy fed they'll, they'll probably approve you within uh two to three three days if you are lucky but connexus actually has a, a pretty uh they, they have a, a practice in place where they will approve uh your your application for a credit card or a line of credit or loan for that matter within 24 hours that's really good okay that's number one number two when we think about loans loans from uh connexus the cool thing is that connexus actually allows you to uh, to get approved real fast especially when it comes to uh giving you the loan like releasing the funds okay so that's kind of cool the second credit unit that's better than navy fed is ccu consumers credit union by the way all the credit unions i'll share with you into this conversation you can you can you can be approved without no uh without uh, affiliation to the military that's, that's true for Connexus. That's also true for CCU. CCU stands for Consumers Credit Union. And basically, uh, with uh, CCU, you can actually get a, a proof for a loan that's act, that goes all the way to $100,000. So, w w uh, whereas uh, Navy Fed was uh, limiting you at uh, 50 k CCU actually is very generous and is granting you a maximum of, of uh, $100,000. So, they have loans, they have lines of credit, they have credit cards. That's really fantastic. And... Uh, also, the approval process is really uh, open, so you don't have to have a, an affiliation to the military to actually qualify for a CCU uh, CCU uh, a CCU membership. Okay, and of course, also on the banking side, fantastic. They have a, a variety of uh, of uh, banking products from checking account all the way to a certificate of deposits. Fantastic. If you're thinking about the credit unions that are better than Navy Fed this year, I want you to think about Blue Fed and why Blue Fed is better than credit uh, than, than Navy Fed. Well, for two things. Number one, Blue Fed actually uh, approves you no matter where you are located at. It doesn't matter if you are if you are in New York, if you are whatever. I mean, the lo the location doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if you if you have a let's say a relation to the military. Okay, not a problem. You can you can be approved. So that's one. The second thing is that Navy uh, not Navy Fed Blue Fed actually. Uh, Gives you more flexibility in terms of uh, use of loan proceeds, so you can use you can use uh, loans, for instance, from uh, Blue Fed to actually uh, to actually uh, take care of home improvement projects. You can consolidate high interest debt. You can take care of medical and dental expenses, or even travel and vacation. So this is really fantastic. The fourth credit union that's better than uh, Navy Fed this year is Fairwinds. Why Fairwinds? Fairwinds actually uh, number one because uh, you can be approved for. Uh, for a, for a large loan, so you can go all the way to a one hundred thousand dollars. And number two, Fairwinds actually has a a good a, a good a good area of uh, credit cards that you can qualify for. And the minimum they want you to have is five thirty. Five thirty, that's really cool. Okay, and of course, actually, what we love also about Fairwinds is that you don't have to actually be uh, affiliated with the military. You don't have to uh, live in a place like a military base, or whatever. You don't have to be a veteran, or whatever. No. You can be approved no matter what. Okay. The only thing is with Fairwinds, they they have a an element of geo restriction, so they are present in a, in a few states. So you just gotta make sure that you are actually you live in those states to actually qualify. So they uh, right now Fairwinds is present in Alabama, Arizona, California, Colorado, Connecticut, Florida, Georgia, Massachusetts, North Carolina, Pennsylvania, South Carolina, Tennessee, Texas, Utah, Virginia, and Washington State. So. You can say, well, you might say, well, it's, it's not a lot, but hey, listen, if you, I mean, that's like what, 10, 15 states out of 50, that, that's a good, that's a good 33%. So that, that's really good. I mean, we, we love that. 
that variety in terms of uh, geography anyway. Fantastic. When you think about the, the a great credit union that's better than uh, Navy Fed this year, I want you to think about BECU. So BECU stands for Boeing Employees of Credit Union, a fantastic credit union, really wonderful. And they have loans that they have a good AP, APRs, like uh, starting at uh, 8%. So that's really good, going all the way to uh, 16%. Fantastic. You can borrow it now. BECU is not really uh, generous in terms of loans. I mean, uh, Navy Fed is better than uh, BCU in terms of generosity because Navy Fed is giving you a 50K and maximum in terms of loans and BCU is giving you a 30K. So, you know, you see the Delta there. But what we love about BCU is that anybody can qualify and uh, BCU is, is also very more, is, is more flexible, excuse me, is more flexible when it comes to uh, the repayment window. Okay, so you are looking at uh, 72 months as opposed to a uh, 60 months. So. That's like two, six years as opposed to five years that Navy Fed uh, is giving you. Next, I want to share with you a uh, service CU. So if you're looking for a credit union that's better than Navy Fed this year, I want you to think about service CU. Now, service CU is actually a great, even though a service CU wants you to be a, has, wants you to have a, a relationship with the military. What we love about service CU is that they approve real fast. They approve real fast. I mean, we have seen folks who ha we got approved for a service CU, a loan or credit card within uh, within 12 hours. So you, so you actually apply in the morning like around 9, 9, 9 a.m. Eastern and by 3 p.m. Eastern, you, you, you get your, your your loan approved. So that's that's really fantastic. And service CU actually allows you to uh, be approved as a seller earlier to be approved for a loan that goes all the way to $50,000. And you can use the loan for a lot of things, you know, for vacation, travel, medical bills, debt consolidations, I mean, you name it, they'll, they'll take care of it. You know, auto repairs, moving costs, the wedding costs, and more. So you have flexibility there in, in terms of uh, dealing with uh, service CU. One thing I want to say about service CU is that they that they want you to be a member for at least one month. One month before you can apply for a credit product. But for banking, no problem. There's no restriction. But for uh, credit, you got to be a member for like a member in good standing for one month before you apply for a credit card a line of credit, or a personal loan. If you're looking for a credit union that's better than Navy Fed this year, I want you to think about American Heritage. Why is American Heritage actually a better than Navy Fed? Well, for a couple of reasons. Number one, basically in terms of loans, they can approve you all the way to uh, $100,000, okay? Number two, they have no restrictions in terms of membership. So basically, uh, you can you you can you can qualify for an American Heritage uh, membership uh, process, no matter where you are at, no matter no matter whom you are affiliated with, no matter whom you work for. Okay. Now, if you cannot actually qualify for a membership, uh, the the straightforward manner, you can actually just uh, qualify through uh, by donate by donating uh, money to uh, let's say uh, a charity. So that that's really fine. And what I want to say also is that what we love about uh, American Heritage is that th this credit union is also, is also very fast in terms of approving loans and lines of credit and um, credit cards. Now, one thing you want to do here is you want to contact uh, American Heritage real, real fast. I mean, don't actually do things online because uh, they have a they have a, a process in place where you can actually apply for credit from the website, right? But don't do that. What you want to do is you want to contact uh, the credit union itself. You want to really call a customer service rep, explain uh, your situation. And what you want to do is you want to really apply for a credit product right after you 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 got approved for a membership. So you get approved for membership, you can open a checking account or a savings account or even a CD for that matter, so that you can actually uh, establish your NPR with uh, American Heritage. NPR stands for what? Multi product relationship. You want to really uh, establish a relationship with uh, this credit union so you can start building uh, some kind of a report with them. So that by the time you uh, you apply for a loan or line of credit or or credit card, you had you had already established that kind of relationship with them. Okay, and one thing I, well, one thing we love about uh, American Heritage also, and that uh, Navy Fed doesn't have, is that American Heritage they do have a a loan calculator on their website, and that loan calculator allows you to have an idea of how much you could actually be paying back to American Heritage if you were to be approved. So that's kind of fine because it gives you an idea about uh, your cash inflows and cash outflows in relations to the credit product that you are about to get with uh, 
with American Heritage. And that's kind of cool because it helps you with uh, DTI, debt to income ratio, and CUR, credit utilization ratio calculations. Another credit union that's better than Navy Fed this year, in our view, and that's Alliant. And uh, so what we love about Alliant here is that Alliant allows you to uh, to actually have a lot of things. Number one, Alliant is very generous in terms of uh, personal loans. Can you imagine that Alliant is giving you uh, up to $100,000, whereas the Navy Fed is actually capping you at uh, 50K? So that's half that, okay? So if you are interested in actually getting a a large loan, a consequential loan for you or, or your family. Let's say you have a home improvement home improvement project or you are trying to really uh, get extra cash for, for your sole proprietorship business or you are also trying to make sure that you get the, the funds you need for a vacation or what have you. Basically, Alliant actually could be a great, a great uh, credit union to actually think about. So you can use uh, actually an Alliant loan or a personal line of credit for loan consolidation, home expenses, or emergencies for that matter. And Alliant also has a, a series of credit cards that are actually uh, are very generous in terms of uh, credit limit, that credit limit that uh, that's approved. So we love that a lot. And another thing we love, uh, another reason why Alliant is better than Navy Fed is that, of course, the membership is open to 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 anybody, right? You don't have to uh, to have uh, like to have an uncle or or, or aunt who works for the military to qualify. You don't have to work for a military base. You can be anywhere in the country, even even Alaska or Hawaii, and you can qualify. I say even because uh, usually some of those institutions, they want you to be on the continental USA. If you are in those, uh, if you're not if you're not in the contiguous uh, 48 states, they do not want to deal with you, but not, not Align. Align will work with you, not a problem. In terms of the loan that you get through uh, Align, you, you have five years to actually pay it off. So whether whether it is a one thousand or one hundred thousand dollars, you have one to five years to pay it off. So that that's really something to think about. And one thing I also want to say is that if you really analyze the customer service opportunities that you have, I mean, Align is way better than uh, than the Navy Fed, way better than Lending Club, way better than Discover for that matter. Those are not credit unions for sure. But I just want to give you a a comparative analysis. If you are looking for a credit union better than Navy Fed this year, I want you to think about First Tech. And uh, so what we love about First Tech is that First Tech, you can actually uh, pre-qualify. You can pre-qualify for a loan through a First Tech website. You can pre-qualify for a credit card through a First Tech's website. That's good. That's really good. And First Tech actually will work with you and they, 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 they will approve you within uh, 12, 24 to 48 hours. Okay. And what, what what really makes First Tech different from credit from my Navy Fed is that First Tech, of course, you can qualify. You don't have to be uh, to have a, a a tech job. You don't have to be in IT or what have you know that you can actually qualify by donating uh, to uh, to a charity, a third party charity. And uh, but what I want to say, what we love about First Tech is that you have no payment for up to forty five days. So after you get your loan from them, they they give you a, a waiver of uh, forty five days, a month and a half. For you to really uh, sort of rebalance your your cash inflows and cash outflows, and really uh, sort of uh, re stabilize your uh, your budget before starting making payments, okay? And but what we love about the first tech is that first tech gets you get you the cash real fast. I mean, you can borrow uh, from five hundred dollars to fifty thousand dollars. You have a fast online application. You have a fixed rate and fixed monthly payments, so that's kind of cool. And uh, you have the ability to get all all kinds of uh, possibilities through uh, first tech. So. You can qualify for a personal loan. You can qualify for a, a personal credit card or, or what have you. And also, uh, there are secured loans that are kind of cool too. So you have a uh, stock secured loans, stock secured line of credit. You have certificate secured loans. You have savings secured loans. Those are pretty good as well. And uh, the reason why those secured loans are good is because they allow you to actually build credit real fast. So you can build credit, and you can actually uh, increase your credit your credit score by say ten to uh, forty five for 45 uh, points within uh, one to two months. I mean, we've tried it. We actually have uh, have advised a lot of clients actually uh, on, on that route. Fantastic, okay? So First Tech is a, is a great credit union that, that allows you to get things done a lot fast. And by the way, I want to insist on the fact that, that you, with, uh, with the First Tech, you have a soft credit pool process. So this will not, will not affect your credit score, right? 
and uh, that's a good way to know what you can qualify for. If you are looking for a credit union better than Navy Fed this year, I want you to consider Andrews. And Andrews is really good in terms of a functionality. Andrews is really good in terms of uh, customer service. And Andrews is really good also in terms of uh, flexibility, in terms of uh, funding, okay? Yeah, granted, Andrews is going to give you a maximum a maximum of uh, $50,000. Uh, 50, but they are better than the Navy Fed in the sense that they allow you to actually repay your loan within uh, 84 to 108 months. So 84 months, that's seven years all the way to all the way to uh, 108. That's like uh, what? That's uh, nine, nine, nine years. So you have uh, seven years to nine years. So that's really good. So you are able to reduce your monthly payments. I mean, the longer the repayment window, the, the, the better it is for you. If you're trying to reduce actually your your uh, weekly payment, your monthly payments. One thing I want to say here is that you 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 have to be uh, at least an Andrew Andrews, a federal credit union member for at least 90 days to actually qualify for the loan or credit card for that matter. And uh, basically, uh, you are able to uh, get your cash real fast. And uh, one thing I need to say is that uh, there is no geo restriction. Yes, basically, uh, you 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 could work, you could uh, live in D in Washington D.C., Maryland, Virginia, New Jersey, or beyond, but you can actually uh, qualify even if you are in Alaska because uh, you have the possibility to donate to a charity and become a, a member of, of Andrews right away. So th that's really good. And uh, what we love also is that Andrew has been trying to change things for the last uh, for the last uh, three years, especially during COVID and after COVID. They, were, they actually were, revamp were revamping uh, their, their strategies a lot, especially when it comes to uh, serving customers. So nowadays, they have actually have invested heavily in uh, in the app though so their mobile app is really really good you're able to do all kinds of stuff with the mobile app so that's something we love a lot especially when it comes to uh, making sure that you're getting uh, your loan or you're getting your the the use of loan proceeds you're getting uh, the proceeds from your loan real fast so that's really fantastic so long story short if you're considering uh, andrews this year i want you to think about credit cards i want you to think about the uh, personal loans i want you to think about by the way they call it personal signature loans signature loans you also have uh, some type of a uh, payday loan through uh, andrews they call it the uh, cash to go loan and this you are getting somewhere from 250 to 500 dollars of dollars and that's really good if you just want a small a small uh, sort of a, a small line of credit to maybe fix some overdraft issues or whatever that's really good and uh, but uh, you got to be uh, remember, you got to be at least a member for 90 days and you got to have a direct deposit allotment for two months from the same employment from the from the same employer. So Andrews just wants to make sure you have stability in terms of uh, your uh, in terms of your 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 employment situation. So here's a recap here in today's conversation. I spoke to you about uh, credit unions that are better than every Fed. I give you the list. And now the recap. So the list, you have Connexus, Consumers Credit Union, you have uh, Blue Fed, you have uh, Fairwinds, BECU, Service CU, you have uh, American Heritage, you have Alliance, you have First Tech, and finally you have Andrews. Thank you so much. God bless you. I'll see you next time. Until then, remember, stay marvelous.